Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to my trying a new makeup product everyday series. Today I am so excited to be trying out another AOA Studio makeup product. It feels like it's been a little while since I've tried out an AOA product and AOA Studio, which is the Shop Miss A exclusive brand, is one of my favorite makeup brands. They make such amazing and affordable products like this one here. Their coconut lip mask only cost $1.88 and that's because it's the charitable edition. Normally the products are only a dollar, but I am happy to pay a little bit over a dollar and have some of the money go to charity. It says this coconut lip mask is to nourish and soften your lips formulated with coconut oil and vitamin E for intense hydration, can be used as an intensive overnight treatment mask or as a regular lip balm. So I feel like I'm always talking about how dry and chapped my lips are. And as we're getting into the colder weather now, I just know that my lips are going to be struggling even more than they already are. But I love lip masks. They have really helped me. I actually use a lip mask every night and the lip mask that I'm currently using and almost done with is actually from AOA Studio. The Jelly Jam lip mask, it is so good. Seriously a dupe for the Laneige lip masks, which are other lip masks that I also love. If you want to see my review of the AOA Studio Jelly Jam lip mask, I'll have that video linked in the description down below. But this also reminds me a lot of another lip mask that I love that I got from Shop Miss A, which is from the brand Beauty Treats, their coconut lip mask. And if you haven't seen my review of that, I'll have that linked in the description down below. But I am so excited to see lip masks available for such inexpensive prices. And just the fact that lip masks are very accessible, prevalent, because I absolutely love them and I feel like I need them and I cannot go back to not using a lip mask. I actually use it as part of my morning skincare as well. And I can just tell like as soon as I'm done washing my face, the first thing I wanna do is put on my lip mask. I just cannot go without it. And since I really can't go without it morning and night, I don't wanna be spending like $20 on every Laneige lip mask. So I'm really excited to try out another much less expensive option. And I mean, this is a good size and I like the packaging. It's of course cruelty free, which is what all Shop Miss A products are. It smells just as good as I was hoping. It smells like a sweet coconut. Oh, it smells so good. Oh, there's some coming out already. I'm gonna just go ahead and Normally I'll squeeze it right out from the applicator onto my lips, but since a lot <laughs> came out when I accidentally squeezed it, I'm just gonna go ahead and put a little on my lips. It definitely has like a white color to it. Oh my gosh, I am loving this scent. Wow. Okay, good. Once I rub it in, it does go clear. But I was a little worried at first, like if it has a lot of a white color to it, it's not something that I'll be able to wear during the day. But rubbing it in, this definitely looks fine. And a little goes a long way. I honestly probably only needed like half <laughs> of that dollop that came out. So I'm just like kind of like rubbing it into my hands, which are of course dry, but wow. Absolutely moisturizing. It's kind of like a lotion for my lips because it was a little bit more of a thin, runnier type of formula than the typical lip masks that I'm used to, which are more of a gel formula. So completely, deeply moisturizing on the lips. My lips are no longer the least bit chapped. They look smoothed out also, which is great. And since this is a slightly thinner lip mask formula, I feel like this would be a really great base for lipsticks, especially like those drying matte liquid lipsticks. I think this is exactly what my lips need underneath. But I also think this is a great throw on moisturizing lip product for any time. 
and it does seem to have more of a natural finish like it doesn't have gloss or shine to it which I personally during the day do prefer more of a glossy shine which the lip masks that come in the tub that are more of that gel formula have more of the shine than this one here but still like I am so impressed by this I highly recommend this if you have chapped lips like I do and if you have tried this please let me know your thoughts on it in the comments down below but if you've not tried this out but you have other favorite lip masks I of course would love to hear your recommendations well thank you so much for watching my video today be sure to like comment and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day and I will see you tomorrow in my next video.